So the number one thing I've always said again and again is you have to establish your place of residence, your principal place of residence. And I, somebody wrote in a case, actual dwelling place without regarding to intent, a place in and from the alien conducts his or her life. That's the test. That's what you make your notebook to prove I live there. That's what you got to do. And if you can't get over that burden of proof, you can't pass the first test. And the things that we encourage and help people do is like, show us you have a home there. You're married to a local. Ownership in property. Working at a job there. Uh, local involvement. The community past travel that you went and come back to there. And, I, and people come to us and we, we, we strategize their things. Like I have this funny thing about, uh, we try to really follow the training program of foreign service officers. And it's so important, funny thing, something about churching. So I tell these people, join that church down the street even if you never go there and give them $250 a year so they can give you a certificate that you remember uh, Holy James of something St. Church in Barbados or wherever it be. Join the local Rotary Club. Join the men's bowling club where you get a certificate that you were the last and the worst bowler in the thing and they give you a piece of paper. <laughs> and I've done that and we show these papers and hey, hell, he, look here, he's the worst bowler that there is in the Philippines. 